What is going on guys? Thank you so much for tuning in back to the channel. Today is our long-awaited Mako paint prep video for Alina's car. This is our part four of Alina's transformation on the FRS. Getting the wide body kit ready, the wheels are all ready. Everything is ready except for us. So we need to actually sand this entire car down, put some Bondo on a couple places, sand it smooth, and get this car looking right just so we can get it ready for the paint job. Now, paint jobs next week. We're gonna be going for $1,000 for the budget from Mako. The sale ends April 15th, so we're kind of in a bind right now. So we're gonna take you guys along with us. We're gonna go hit up Harbor Freight, get some supplies real fast, and then start working on the car. So let's go get it done. Should be fine. 50 discs of 220 and then 600 grit. Yeah. Good. Sandpaper is good. That this one looks one's, nice. This one's 24 bucks. All right. This should be good. Oh, Bondo. Yeah, that looks good to me. Definitely need this. Spending too much money already, I can tell. I think that's everything, huh? Smaller one. Hello. I want that. Have a good one. Yeah, All right, let's go. Okay, we're back. We got a bunch of stuff from Harbor Freight. Everything to complete the bodywork on the car. So we're gonna set up the canopy because it's hot today and get started. Quick update on Lena's car. So we took it to the body shop. They were able to brass fill all five holes that I requested. They hooked it up for me. Brought them a case of Tecate and they did the job real fast on my lunch break. So that was awesome. And also yesterday, Alina put on the new fenders. They look great. We got them for 140 bucks. Um, they do have holes in them, but we're going to be chopping right around there anyway. Anyway, so she got the new fenders on. They look awesome. So let's hit this car with some sandpaper, Alina, right? Yeah. Let's go. All right, guys, that is it for the sanding today. We are all sanded out and really dusty. We spent about five hours roughly sanding. Is it worth it to sand your own car in order to prep for the Mako paint job? In I think our, it is. Yeah, in our eyes, yes. Five, six hours worth of sanding is definitely uh, gonna save us some money. It also ensures that when you send your car into Mako, the work is already done. You don't have to worry about them. Oh, well, did they only sand this part of the car and all that kind of stuff. From what I've heard in our uh, Blue Miata Mako paint job, a uh, few people said that Mako actually only has a seven minute timer on when like body work in occurs. So if they're only sanding the car, like it took us five hours to do this. If they're really only taking seven minutes of their day to sand the car, then I'm definitely gonna wanna put in the time and work of our own just to get it exactly how we want it. Because when you do your own paint work, you don't get the warranty with Mako. So that is one thing to keep in mind. All right, so the car is now completely done in 600 grit. It's basically the number you're gonna wanna be at when they spray the car. It feels smooth, 
but when you sand it to a 220 first and then you go to a 600 you could definitely feel the difference in the panels at some points in time i actually forgot where i was sanding but if you just run your hand across you can definitely feel where it stops and starts of when the new grit occurs so when you go from 220 to 600 you're gonna know exactly uh just by the feel of it the car looks pretty crazy right now obviously kind of looks like a cartoon with uh, lines drawn everywhere okay so i'm actually really happy with the way this came out and i'm super excited because next week we get to actually send in the car for paint for the most part it is technically done bodywork wise but off camera throughout the week until saturday we will be taking out the rest of the trim pieces is off camera because honestly we don't even know how to take them off we don't want to break them last thing we have to do is hose it off because it's super dusty yeah we got things to do i got a tattoo appointment today i'm excited Let's and see, nervous oh you want to see the tats i'm gonna get a hula girl in the back right here yeah anyway let's yeah let's hose it down <laughs> Alright guys, and like that, the car is ready for paint besides the other little things we're going to do off camera. So in the next couple videos, you guys will actually see the outcome of the paint job. So be sure to hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all the builds. Make sure you don't miss that next video because it is going to be a pretty good one. And you know what guys? Leave a like for six hours of sanding. It really is going to mean a lot to us if you do that because we are beat. Our arms feel like they're vibrating my hands. I can't really close them that well. Look at my pants. Look how dusty she is. But anyways, if you want to stay up to date on all the builds at 86 Goals for TikTok and Instagram, you can see behind the scenes footage over there. But anyways, we'll see you in the next video, guys. New uploads every Monday. Take it easy.